the main reason I choose to enter this competition is to learn the public speaking skill and how to simplify uh, the science to so the people so the public can understand. I like interacting with other people who are doing PhDs. I like interacting with audiences. I think it's very important getting our research out there because usually academics are kind of an isolated community and the more you get the word out there the better it is for you. Whether it is for funding, whether it is for becoming known for what you're doing. Simple as that. It was a chance to discuss your research. Um, really great experience to be able to in engage with public speaking and also to think of ways of putting your research over to a public audience which I think is really, really important. For me, I'm doing my Viva and PhD exam in about two weeks' time, and the, the, the timeline of this worked out really well, so I thought it would be just generally beneficial to practice summarising what I'm doing in a nice three minutes, I guess. So it was sort of practical, you know, reason for doing it to benefit me. I wasn't that too fussed about the competitive aspect, so it was just to help me along to finish and get it done. It was a good opportunity to do something new and uh, just a uh, challenge yourself basically, do something really crazy and it was really scary but it's done and it was fine and there was a good kind of group that we were working with all the time so it was kind of fun to do. Uh, today I've learned like practice, I need to practice more so and I should do more of this kind of thing so I can get rid of my nervousness and it was, it's a good experience. It went really well, I had a pause and I recovered really well and that is the the key ingredient, it's not that I had to stumble, it's that I did genuinely pull it back really well. So that is a moral victory for me because that's the thing that could go wrong but it wasn't that big a deal. So I guess it's a, a reality check that things are never quite as bad as you think. But it went really well and I think the main thing is that everyone massively upped their game in the last week from the feedback. So if I've learned anything it's to, to get feedback from people before you do a talk because it really changed it for me and for everyone else. I think everyone would agree with that. So good feedback last week equals much better talks today. It's nerve-wracking, uh, but it's great fun. Um, it's been a really good crowd. It's been really useful to meet other PhD students from all the different schools. I think that's possibly been one of the major benefits is, is kind of meeting new friends and seeing how other people do things. Uh, but no, it's been great fun.